All right, uh, today's video is going to be on how to install MIUI on the Motorola Droid X2. And this one you should install on top of Android version 2.3.4. This is MIUI V version 2.8.3. 10 and this is a beta release. This is based off a lot of the stuff that Dragon Killer did in CM9. So, to install this, you're going to boot into System Recovery or Bootstrap Recovery. You're going to hit install. And okay. Plug in your power cord which is plugged into a wall charger. And hit recovery mode now some prerequisites are you want to make sure you have already downloaded the MIUI ROM you want to make sure you downloaded the latest MIUI GGAPS and if you want you can download the blue sleep fix which actually allows your device to go into full sleep mode so that you have better battery life when the device is not in use um, so Make sure those are on your device and you know where they are on your SD card. And then once we get in here, we will go ahead and flash this thing and check it out. Come on, Clockwork Mod Recovery. All right, we uh, booted into Clockwork Mod Recovery. So we're going to go down to Wipe Data Factory Reset and select with the power button. Scroll down with the volume button here to delete all user data. Click select yes. Um, before you do any of this, you might want to do a backup, but I've already done that. All right, wipe cache partition. Scroll down to yes. And select it. Perfect. Last, we're going to go down to advanced. And then wipe Delvic cache and select that. Say yes. All right, so we've wiped our big three. We're going to go back. And we're going to do apply um, SD card. No, sorry, I'm sorry here. Um, install zip from SD card right there. Select that one. Um, choose zip from SD card. Select it. And then I'm going to scroll down to where I have uh, MIUI ROMs. That's where I put these. Select it. And then I'm looking for the MIUI 2.8.10-3 zip. And I'm going to install that and hit yes. All right, this is going to install the ROM. And then next, I'm going to install the MIUI GGAPS. And uh, we'll go from there. Oh, here, there's a little cool graphic. It says, Welcome, MIUI US V4 ice cream sandwich port for the Droid X2. All right, says install complete. So we're going to scroll down to choose zip from SD card. Select. Again, go down to where it says MIUI ROMs. At least that's where I installed mine. Yours might be in downloads. And then we're going to go to, let's see here. Let's see if I can get the name of this thing right. Oh, here it is. MIUI GGAPS. That's the one I want. Select it and then hit install. Yes. All right, so it's going to install the gaps. Hopefully, it doesn't take too long. Oh, there you go, really quick. Um, lastly, you can go in here and flash the let's see here, MIUA ROMs, and you can go to Blue Sleep Fix Zip, select it, and select yes and flash. All right. So go back, and now we're going to do a reboot device, and we'll see what we come up with here. Um, should boot up with MIUI. I don't know what their boot animation is going to be. So hopefully you can see it without it being too bright on the camera here. That is the MIUI boot animation, MIUI US, United Worldwide. So it's a sing boot. All right, finally booted up here. That took a good, good little while to get uh, get ourselves booted up. 
Um, now this is the activation screen. This shouldn't come up for you if you're already activated. Uh, this phone is not. That's why it came up. Um, so lock screen here. You got some different options here. Texting, phone, camera. All those are right on the lock screen. So we're going to unlock. And this is the MIUI. So let's uh, let's see what we got here. Here's your basic uh, kind of look on it. You really don't have an app drawer so much on this. This is more like um, more like an iPhone, where all of your apps are going to be uh, on the desktop here. So. I like it. I think it's pretty cool. Um, the developer of this ROM suggested a couple things I'm going to show you how to do right now to turn off just to make this thing run better. Which we're going to go into settings here. And we're going to go um, complete settings. And then scroll to the bottom where it says developer options. Alright. So this is where we're going to change right here. Um, so let's see if I can show you. Um, okay, right here. Show rounded corners. We want to turn that off. Um, that's one thing. And then we want to go into um, Windows Animation Scaling. And we want to turn it off. And we want to go into Transition Animation Scaling and also turn it off. That's just going to make this thing run a lot smoother and faster for you. Um, so... Uh, let's see some other things on MIUI. Um, see our dialer. Let's see what we got in this. There's your dialer. Pretty cool. You can go to people. I don't think I have anything in here right now. Um, let's see tools. Some built-in tools you got in here. Torch, firewall, a bunch of different things. Uh, this does have themes. You can download their MIUI themes and theme this thing way crazily. It's really cool. I like the themes a lot. A lot of different neat themes in there. Um, got your Play Store right there. A virus scanner built into it. File Explorer. DSP Manager. Um, weather. So that's your, your basic, you know, you got your clock, your search bar up here on top. That's uh, basically what you got. Now this is going to have the exact same bugs that um, Dragon Killer's CM9 has because it's based off of that. Um, so anything that that's working on there should work on here. Anything that's not working on there should not work on here, obviously. Now let's check, let's check camera and see if camera does function. And yes, it does. And you're looking at white, but it does function. So that is good. That camera is functional. Um, let's see what else. We'll go back into settings here. Kind of go through some more settings on this thing. Um... So you got your Wi-Fi, your Bluetooth, you know, standard stuff there. You got some status bar. Status bar stuff you can look at here. Let's see what it is. All right. Oh, you can change the style of your notification bar. That's what it is. So this has got a pull down with a ton of toggles on it. Um, you can just change the way you want that to look. Yeah, you guys really can't see this. Let me see if I can adjust display on this thing so you guys can see it a little better. Um, settings, display... Brightness. Let's see if I can tune it down for you a little bit. There, hopefully that's a little bit better. Um, let's go back into settings. So status bar. Yeah, there we go. Um, yeah, you can change some of the customized status bar notifications. You can change the look of it, where you can have a lot of different toggles on here, or you can have just a couple different toggles, and we can look more like let's see up oh, changing toggle style hang on a sec and we can have just a row on the bottom of toggles so different ways of doing it some customization the themes are awesome that's what definitely what I would check out um, so far pretty nice pretty smooth I like it um, so you can see your APKs oh, I like this your themes that are on here documents it kind of categorizes it all for you um, that's pretty cool uh, you can also look at just look at your SD card let's see if that comes up there we go there's your SD card on here. So I like I like that. I like categories. I think that's a really neat little feature. It also gives you your percentage down here used and free. So um, let's go back out. 
So yeah, there you go. That is the uh, newest MIUI on the Droid X2. Um, hope you like guys like this review. Um, go ahead, check it out yourself. Just make sure you are on Android version 2.3.4 before flashing, and uh, kind of go from there. So hope you guys liked it, and we'll catch you guys later. Thanks.